What's up guys? It is Thursday, I think. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be headed to the shop just like any other day. And I'm gonna update you guys on my car because the I think two days ago I went to court and I finally finalized everything from my state ref. So I'll talk to you guys a little bit more um, when we get to the shop. So that way I don't, I don't have to rush and be late. So yeah, and then I'll sh also show you Ralph's Evo that he's currently rebuilding. And it should be starting up any day now. And yeah, it's gonna be really cool. Um, every a lot of the parts are from skunk too so shout out to them um, but yeah so I'll talk to you guys when I get to the shop this is the street I always take to get straight to work and uh, Ralph if you're watching this this is exactly why I'm gonna be a couple minutes late because now I gotta freaking go another route just to get to the shop so bye hey. if I'm not I'll let you know like way beforehand hey. I love you. I love you, babe. Alright guys, so I just got to the shop and here's my car. Yes, it's freaking dirty. And in the last video, I was trying to explain to you guys why I have Ralph's uh, Evo wheels on my car. It's because my old tires on my Rays were super freaking bald. So ASAP, I need to get some new tires, which I've already have ordered on Will Call. I just have to go pay for them and pick them up. And then I'll have my rays back on, so I know it looks really weird right now. And it's also super dirty, so one of these days I have to dedicate my whole day to cleaning my car again, so that way I can get dirty in like two days after that. Because you know, black cars freaking suck dick. Anyways, let's get to work in the shop. So I'm about to get started working on the website and just to update you guys from the last time I talked about it I don't know how many products we were at last time um, But right now we are currently at 2,500 plus 2,586 to be exact and so we have everything from what you need as far as suspension intakes uh, We have the skunk 2 manifolds on there. We also have coilovers. We have a couple uh, sizes of RPF ones so that way um, you can get some for your Honda or your Evo. That's the specs that we have on there for right now. And then we have a bunch of other stuff too, as such as the Craftsworks Supercharger. We have K-Tune products. So make sure you guys check out the website and use my code Daniel5 or anyone else's codes that are out there like Vega5. Who cares? Use the code. Get your parts cheaper. And uh, let's help you by you helping us. So I'm going to get work to working. Guys, so today is the day that I have to give uh, Ralph back his Evo wheels. So that's what I'm gonna do. He just left right now to El Monte to pick up a part for his Evo so we can get the bitch running. Anyways, so I've been taking off my wheels all by myself. I know to you guys it may not sound like a big deal, but to me it is. I usually don't do shit by myself, but hey, I'm doing it. But I take one wheel off because I was doing it without vlogging. But I was like, hey, let me vlog this just so that way I can get the street cred. You know what I'm saying? one is solved I got it out I don't know if you guys realize what was going on but my freaking nut got stuck first on the stud and then when I got it off it got stuck inside the key oh my god I had to go next door to ask I had to call my friend uh, Ralph twice and then he gave me the advice to hit it with the hammer as you're pulling it out off of the stud so that's what got it and that's probably not like your, you know like your Walmart like that's not the advice you give but whew, 
we got that shit off, man. It's hot as shit outside. And I still got freaking three more to go. Well, two more to go to take off and then to put back on. So I got one more to put on. Whew. I'm gonna stop filming, guys, because you guys are just gonna see me fuck up this whole time. <laughs> it's hot. Anyway, so I'll catch up with you guys as soon as I'm done so that way you guys don't see my problems anymore. So currently I have to do one more side and it's the right side of the car. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. I just wanted to continue on vlogging because I didn't want to leave you guys out of it. Um, but yeah, so the, basically the reason why I had to borrow his Evo wheels is because these wheels or these tires are completely done. They're shot, guys. So I've already had some wheels or uh, some tires on wheel call that I have to go pick up as soon as I get some time. I'm hoping I can go tomorrow if uh, Ralph uh, permits that. So uh, yeah, so I'm gonna have to get some tires eventually so that way I can be running good, I can be running safe because these shits are really scary to drive on right now. I'm not even gonna lie. But yeah, guys, so I'll put the camera down and I'll, I'll, I'll do it again. I'll, I don't know, you can see me fuck up again. Why not, who, who cares? I'm finally done. I don't know why, so I'm so out of breath, but it's hot, and I'm not used to. <laughs> I'm not used to doing this by myself, but it's a good thing. Lesson learned, uh, guys. I recommend you put your hands on your own car because when it comes to times like this, it gets a little harder. I'm telling you guys, I never do this. My friends always do my shit, and it's a good thing to always learn how to do it. But as you guys saw in a couple of videos ago, when we had to take off my manifold and all that stuff. Uh, I did pretty good. I helped a lot, so I'm trying to be more hands-on with stuff like this. So yeah, I'm gonna clean up and I'm gonna get back inside and chill out. Hold on. All right, guys. So yesterday I made a post on my Instagram story about how I miss my old wheels because a memory came up with my old RPF ones, and my good friend OC Jerry might be trading me his RPF ones, but this time in silver. So I'm gonna be a hot boy. So. I'll let you know um, next time I'm gonna vlog. Hopefully it's tomorrow. Hopefully I finish this video by tonight and have it up for tomorrow. This weekend is I bought guys. I'll be there with no one else but Skunk 2. So make sure you guys come to the booth and say what's up and bring some cash so we can spin to win. Peace. Guys, make sure you guys use my code Danimal15 on the Skunk 2 website. You can get this shirt, you can get a sweater, you can get a hat, you can get coilovers, you can get an intake. Anything you guys want, as long as you guys order online, you can use my code DANIMAL15 to save yourself 15%. And that's it. Comment, like, and subscribe. Bye!